In the food and beverage industry, efficiency and cleanliness are paramount. At Hanover Conveying Systems, we understand that the right conveyor belt not only meets hygiene standards, but also enhances production efficiency. For those in the food sector, choosing the correct conveyor belt is critical. Let's explore our top picks for various applications. First up are plastic modular belts. These are made from individual plastic modules. With a lot of these belts, some of the things you can do with it is add accessories to it. So this has a series of rollers in the belt, but you can also get this belt with flights or scoops. There's a multitude of different things you can add to this belt uh, for your application. This kind of shows a different surface textures and, and openings that you can have on the modules themselves. Small, large, uh, textured, smooth. So plastic modular belt typically is a little more expensive than the other types of, of belting. And there, especially on curve belting, we run into issues with length and width of belt. So you're limited as to how far you can go with a curve belt on the length of it. Another great alternative to plastic modular is our tabletop. Yeah, so this is a, a tabletop belt. It's, it's made out of plastic. This is a straight style belt. These are fairly economical. They can go with uh, long runs of, of belts with this style. And you can get this also in a curved style belt. This is actually a, a radius style belt made out of stainless steel. More expensive, but great for wash down and also good for high heat applications. Yeah. Also extremely heavy duty, very tough. Tabletop belt is traditionally a little bit more difficult to clean because there are a lot of knuckles and and hidden areas in these belts that become difficult to, to spray. Stainless steel is a little bit more expensive than the, the plastic and plastic modular belts. So if you're looking to go stainless, you know, expect to pay a little bit more for that, that style belt. So following our tabletop belt is our fabric belt. So this is a piece of fabric belt. These are traditionally used in light duty to very heavy duty applications. Um, great for tight transfers. The thinner the belt, the, the tighter the radius that this belt can go around, which means you get a, a very tight transfer with small objects. Also economical, so you can move product for a very cheap dollar per foot uh, cost and get these in both endless or you can get them laced so that they're easy to take off. They'll put a, either metal lace or clipper lacing in the belt to make it endless. So these would be used in bakery industries. They're lightweight, with a PVC covering um, woven on the back. PVC is great for, for scrapers too. If you have a product that sticks to the belt, mm -hmm. you can use a scraper to, to scrape it off. Mm -hmm. Less easy to clean because there is a, a pattern to the belt. So if you need to wash it down, it does get a little bit more difficult to do that, but it's, it still can be cleaned. Mm -hmm. And the PVC covering on top, uh, that would also have an effect on its heat resistance and its ability to operate in high temperature areas, correct? Right, correct. Okay. These are great because they operate in such a large range of capacities. We can, like Miles said, you can have a, a small dough handling conveyor that, that runs very small pieces of dough up to a, a, a massive you know, steel casting. And the thicker you go with the belt, the higher the capacity is. So a very broad range of loads that these kinds of belts can take. And for the ultimate in hygiene, these are monolithic belts. These belts are made from polyurethane and they're completely monolithic, meaning it's the same material throughout. Fantastic for cleanliness. Mm -hmm. So these are very easy to clean. Uh, there's not a lot of areas on these belts for bacteria or any other pathogens to grow in or, or get harbored in. We can add different types of accessories to the belt. Well, as you can show, we have a belt here with a, a flight. So this is, yep, this is a flight that's just molded directly to the belt, and we can get these in different intervals and different lengths. They're a little bit more expensive, and they're not good for high temperature applications. As soon as you start, there's a, a limitation on the, the temperature you can use these belts. The higher it gets, the, the belt starts to, to expand and, and warp. So you have to be careful uh, what temperature you're using these belts with. In food plants, your product has to be FDA compliant or NSF compliant. Okay. Monolithic belts, styles like these, are what we would typically use in those applications because the material meets FDA, they're more likely to get NSF approval. These are great for, for food applications. Finally, moving from a belt that doesn't do well in high heat, 
Scott, tell us about these metal belts. So these are stainless steel belts used for very high temperature applications. Great for wash down because they are all stainless. Uh, you get very big load capacities out of these belts. They're heavy, a lot heavier than the, the fabric or, or plastic modular belt. These belts can be used in heavy duty applications such as casting and machinery or machining operations, metal processing, anything that requires the product to be dipped in like a painting line or, or uh, something that the material won't get won't affect the belt at all, and they're also expensive, so that's a consideration you have to make when you're designing a conveyor is, is the, does the cost represent enough to be able to use stainless steel in that application. Thank you for watching today's video and learning about the belts we offer here at HCS. At Hanover Conveying Systems, we're committed to elevating safety and productivity with custom conveyor solutions across all industries. Contact us today to find the perfect conveyor belt for your application. Action. There you go. There you go. What would work best with how we went off? Surprise! <laughs> <laughs> no? You don't want to do that? Uh, okay. <laughs> <laughs>